Good evening, friends. It's Chris Angel coming at you from the patio here on Christmas Eve, and it's another episode of Marketing for the Rest of Us, and I'm talking relatively quietly so that I don't over uh, talk too loud for the neighbors. So today we went to Top Golf, the family and I. We went and hit some golf balls at Top Golf. My daughter is 13, my son is 15, my wife was there, uh, my wife's mom was there, so we had a great time hitting balls at Top Golf. And while we were there, uh, my daughter's just getting the hang of it, like I'm giving her some lessons and some tips on how to swing. Uh, my son I've been working with for a couple of years on his swing, so his swing looks pretty good, but there's still some things to work on, right? And it's interesting that when you're working on uh, something like your golf swing, you really don't want to overdo it, right? Like I, I didn't give him, it wasn't like every swing, it was here's another idea, here's another thing, here's another thing, etc. <clears throat> I just wanted to give him one or two things to think about uh, for his swing. And while that happened, I wanted to kind of give him the, um, I wanted to watch him enough times to see what he really needed to hear so that the feedback was appropriate for what would uh, best impact his swing. Okay, so let's take that now and let's apply it to marketing. So the thing about marketing is as business people under pressure, feeling like we need to uh, figure it all out yesterday, what we'll often do is saturate our minds with all kinds of advice, all kinds of marketing advice. And with that, we will try to make all these changes at once. That can be a problem, right? Because when you fill your mind with all the different things, all the different ideas, insights, tools, suggestions, it becomes very hard to hold them all in your mind and do anything with them. With my kids today, with my kids today, I was really just trying to get them to uh, remember one or two things at Top Golf, right? So in their swing, I'm like, here, try this. And then I didn't say anything more, like, just try that, just hit it. And they would look to me, like, look, here's the thing. They would look to me after they tried it and the shot didn't go well. And they'd be like, what else should I try? And I'm like, nope, I'm not giving you more to think about. Just do it again, do it again, do it again, do it again. And I would just let them play with the one thing that I gave them to, to, to practice, right? But in business and as adults, we don't do that. We're like, oh, that one time didn't work. Let me go find a different thing to add in to my business and my marketing. And then you try it one time and that doesn't work the way you want it to. So you go look for another thing and you add that to your business and marketing. You're like, nope, that didn't work. Let me go try another thing. And you add all of these things into your strategies and you completely confuse yourself in the game of marketing. So here's the deal, gang. The principle here is that less is more. Less is more. Only work on, only work on one or two things at a time because you can't really test more than that. You can't test more than one or two things at a time. So only work on one or two things at a time. And don't try it once. Try it again. Try it again. Try it again. And notice what you start to see. Notice the lesson, right? Keep working on it. By the way, don't just try stuff from from anywhere get your advice get your changes to your golf swing if you will if we use the metaphor get your changes from someone who can uh, be an advisor to you don't just get it from anywhere okay pick your sources and then grab the advice and implement that play with it play with it play with it if you want to try something else try one more thing play with it play with it play with it but don't don't go in and overwhelm yourself with all kinds of ideas to try to implement at once. Okay? That's it for tonight, gang. At the time of this recording, it is Christmas Eve. Have a great evening. Have a great day tomorrow. Um, and here's to you taking one thing at a time to implement in your business. If you'd like to learn more how uh, learn more about how I do marketing, how I coach marketing, you can go to marketing uh, you can go to groundswellmethod.com. Watch the free video and you can apply for my six week program called the Groundswell Method Intensive. Okay, until tomorrow, tomorrow's Christmas Day. Until tomorrow, have a great night.